Hi everyone. So today's video is going to be an ode to the bucket bag. Uh, I have recently discovered bucket bags. Uh, I know they've been, well they were really popular over the last couple years uh, and I think, I don't know, do bag styles really ever go like out of style? I don't know. They don't seem to be like quite as popular at this point in time but I have fallen in love with this style. It is just it's so handy and oh my god it holds everything. <laughs> uh, this bag is literally a Mary Poppins bag. I find it amazing. Uh, so my bucket bag here is the Mark by Mark Jacobs Too Hot to Handle Drawstring Bucket Bag. Uh, she popped up at a local consignment shop uh, and she was such an amazing deal that yeah I pounced on this one. And oh, she's like basically has no wear on her whatsoever and I absolutely adore the color. Uh, so she is a gorgeous pebble leather and she has uh, like a handheld, I mean it can go on the shoulder but it's kind of like right there. <laughs> uh, but there is that handle and then she also came with a longer shoulder strap, although maybe it's adjustable uh, so you can make it longer. I don't know I don't know how it would work crossbody. Uh, honestly, I don't use this strap, so I just carry her by this handle. But I just love this style. It is so good for grab and go. And yeah, like I said, <laughs> she holds anything. It's such, this is like the Mary Poppins bag in my collection. Uh, especially because whatever you put in her, like no matter what the shape or the size or whatever it is you're sticking in that bag, she looks like this. <laughs> like there's no weird warping or bulging or anything. It's just amazing. Uh, <laughs> I was inspired to do this video after I was using this bag this week. And I had worn a new pair of flats uh, to the office. And halfway through the day, they were killing my feet. <laughs> so I changed into another pair of shoes I had under my desk that were broken in and comfortable. Uh, but then when I was going home, I was like, well, I want to just keep wearing the comfortable shoes. So I wrapped my other pair of shoes in like a plastic bag. And I was like, well, okay, I'll have this in my plastic bag. And then I was standing there and I was like, but will it fit in the bucket bag? And it did. <laughs> uh, I had all my other daily essentials in there and I just slipped the shoes. And I mean, I'm pretty careful with my stuff. So the shoes weren't like just shoved in the bag. They were both flat side by side and I wrapped the bag and tucked them up really nice because I'm anal about my stuff. <laughs> and even like they fit perfectly in this bag and it didn't look overstuffed. I probably could have still put a sweater in it if I wanted to, but yeah. I'm loving the bucket bag style uh, and I really love this one because as you will see or maybe you won't really see yeah you can see there there's like a seam so it has its own independent bottom it's not like one piece and just kind of sewed up you know so I love that because I I like a good bottom <laughs> on my bags so yeah, absolutely loving the bucket bag style. So excited I tried it out. Uh, and yeah, I kind of want to find a couple other bucket bags. But yeah, this bag is unfortunately discontinued. I think the Mark by Mark Jacobs line in its, in its entirety has been kind of discontinued. I could be really wrong on that. But what I've been seeing from Mark Jacobs anyways is he has just the Marc Jacobs line, but it's less in price than in its heyday with like the stamps and all that stuff. But these are just my observations. It doesn't necessarily mean that they are <laughs> truth <laughs> or like the whole truth, I guess I should say. Uh, but yeah, absolutely adoring the bucket bag style. If you're looking or like you want to branch out of your satchels or whatever, this style is amazing and it holds everything and it's just so chic and put together looking it doesn't you know oh, I love it <laughs> that's basically all I came on here to say <laughs> I have found the bucket bag and I love the bucket bag <laughs> uh, but anyways if you guys are also loving bucket bags let me know down below uh, and if you have any other 
brands that make really good style bucket bags. Uh, I do prefer a shorter handle, but not opposed to just one long one. Just kind of prefer the shorter one. It just, oh, I love this bag. And can we just have a moment for the Mark by Mark Jacobs leather? Because... It's stunning and amazing and smushy and glorious and it wears literally like iron like I don't know who had this bag before I did because <laughs> it was pre-loved from a consignment shop but honestly there's not a mark on this leather it's perfect and the price they were selling it for was unbelievable in my opinion for Mark by Mark Jacobs uh, yeah so Anyways, one of my new additions, <laughs> and I love it, and yeah, I just, if you want to try a new style, highly recommend the bucket bag. <laughs> Anyways, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.